Have you ever wondered about the future of the internet? As we navigate the digital age, cryptocurrencies like Internet Computer Protocol, or ICP, are playing a pivotal role in shaping that future. ICP is not just a cryptocurrency, but a powerful protocol that aims to revolutionize the internet as we know it, forging a path towards a decentralized web 3.0. ICP's native token is a key player in this digital transformation, used for network processing power in this innovative ecosystem. But like many cryptocurrencies, the price of ICP has been a roller coaster ride, with notable price fluctuations making it a point of interest for traders and investors alike. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at ICP's price, exploring its resistance and support levels, and the relative strength index. We'll also delve into the technical analysis of ICP, providing insights into its current performance and future potential. So buckle up, because we're about to dive into the complex, exciting world of ICP and its potential impact on the future of the internet. Let's delve deeper into the world of ICP and its potential impact on the future of the internet. At present, ICP is priced at $12.33, with a market cap of $5.68 billion. Now that's a lot of zeros, but what does it all mean? Let's delve a bit deeper. The circulating supply of ICP, that is the total amount of coins that are currently in circulation and being traded in the market, stands at 462.68 million. This is out of a maximum supply of 488.51 million, showing that a majority of the coins have already hit the market. Now let's talk about volatility. ICP is not for the faint-hearted. Its price has been on a roller coaster ride, experiencing notable fluctuations. One day it's up, the next day, it's down. This is not uncommon in the world of cryptocurrencies, but ICP has had its fair share of peaks and troughs. The swings can be quite dramatic, it, which can be nerve-wracking for some, but thrilling for others. It's this volatility that makes ICP a coin to watch closely. Depending on your viewpoint, it can be seen as a risk or an opportunity. Like any investment, it comes with its own set of challenges, but also potential rewards. So whether you're a seasoned trader or a curious onlooker, keep an eye on ICP. It's certainly making waves in the crypto ocean. And there you have it. This volatility is a key characteristic of ICP, making it a coin to watch closely. In terms of technical analysis, ICP has demonstrated resistance levels at $12.961. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly does this mean? Let's break it down. In the world of cryptocurrency trading, resistance levels are a key concept that traders use to understand market trends. Picture it as a ceiling that a cryptocurrency, in our case, the Internet Computer Protocol, or ICP, struggles to break through. This ceiling is determined by a price point at which selling is thought to be strong enough to prevent the price from rising further. For ICP, this ceiling or resistance level is at $12.961. Every time ICP's price climbs up to this level, it has a tendency to pull back, as if hitting an invisible barrier. This is because at this price, there are more traders willing to sell than there are buyers willing to buy. So, how does this impact ICP's future performance? Well, until the market sentiment changes and there are enough buyers to absorb the selling pressure, the price of ICP will likely struggle to exceed this resistance level. But if the price does manage to break through this resistance, it often results in a significant price increase as more buyers jump in, driven by the momentum of the breakthrough. However, it's important to note that resistance levels are not static. They change with market dynamics and investor sentiment. If a resistance level is broken, it often transforms into a support level, where the price may bounce back up after a decline. But for now, the resistance level of ICP stands at $12.961. And while this might seem like a hurdle, savvy traders can use this information to their advantage. By understanding these resistance levels, they can make strategic decisions about when to buy or sell their ICP holdings. These resistance levels indicate potential challenges that ICP could face in increasing its value. But remember, in the unpredictable world of cryptocurrencies, nothing is set in stone. Stay tuned, stay informed, and keep an eye on those resistance levels. On the flip side, ICP's support levels stand at $11.91. But what does that really mean? 
Well, in the dynamic world of crypto, support levels are the price points that a cryptocurrency rarely falls below, acting as a floor beneath which investors are hesitant to let it drop. It's like a safety net, catching the coin when it starts to fall. This is where the concept of demand comes into play. At these support levels, the perceived value and demand for ICP may increase, attracting buyers who believe the coin is now on sale. This surge in buying pressure can then help the price to rebound, providing a potential opportunity for profit. Now, why are these support levels important? They are crucial in predicting future price trends. If ICP consistently bounces back from its support level, it could signify a strong demand for the coin at that price. This could indicate stability amidst the coin's volatility and potentially point towards an upward trend in the future. However, if the support level is broken, it could suggest a bearish trend, meaning the coin's price may continue to fall. This is why investors keep a keen eye on these levels, as they can provide key insights into market sentiment and the potential future movement of ICP's price. In essence, understanding support levels allows investors to make informed decisions, helping them time their trades more accurately and potentially maximize their returns. So these support levels could be the key to ICP's rebound in the face of market fluctuations. The Relative Strength Index or RSI of ICP currently stands at 43. Now, what does that mean, you might wonder? Well, let me break it down for you. The Relative Strength Index or RSI is a momentum oscillator that measures the speed and change of price movements. It's a tool that traders use to identify overbought or oversold conditions. The scale ranges from 0 to 100, and an asset is generally considered overbought when the RSI is above 70 and oversold when it's below 30. So an RSI of 43 for ICP means it's neither overbought nor oversold. It's somewhat in the middle, leaning towards the oversold territory. This suggests that there's a slightly higher selling pressure, but it's not significant enough to trigger a sell-off or a buying frenzy. It's a delicate balance, and the implications of this on the market sentiment towards ICP are quite interesting. It suggests that the market is somewhat undecided about ICP, which could result in increased volatility as investors grapple with whether to buy, sell, or hold. This RSI level suggests an unstable market sentiment towards ICP, further highlighting its volatility. In conclusion, ICP is a volatile yet intriguing cryptocurrency with the potential to revolutionize the internet as we know it. This digital asset, backed by a protocol that seeks to usher in a decentralized Web 3.0, is currently priced at around $12.33. It has a market capitalization of approximately $5.68 billion and a circulating supply of 462.68 million tokens. Its price has witnessed significant fluctuations, demonstrating resistance levels at roughly $12.96 and support levels at nearly $11.91. The Relative Strength Index or RSI is currently at 43, indicating an unstable market sentiment towards ICP. These factors all contribute to its intriguing nature and volatility making it a fascinating subject for both traders and investors. It's crucial to keep a close eye on these technical indicators and market trends to make informed decisions about this dynamic cryptocurrency. With its volatility and potential, ICP is definitely a cryptocurrency to keep an eye on in the future.